Hey guys, it's me Sneha. This is yet another episode of Film Companions Cheat Sheet and this time you're going on the sets with me. Picture this, a small town family, a mother-in-law who loves her bahus and daughters. Very kyunki saas bhi kabhi bahuti vibes. Typical, right? But hang on, before you hit the snooze button. In the world of homey adhajaniya, saas bahu or flamingo, things are all set to get wild. The show is looking to break all stereotypes and give us some real flamingo-worthy drama. Intrigued yet? Come. Join me as I dive right into the world of Saas, Bahu or Flamingo. Listen, thank you for talking to me in the middle of the chaos while you are in the thick of things. Thank I you. love meeting actors when they are marinating in their character's headspace. Talk to me a little bit about the dynamics on set when you have such dynamic women such as y'all. You know the common misconception, right? So <coughs> women on set constantly trying oh, to Oh, I hate it. you. I hate you. Yeah, I, I hate, hate you, you so I hate much. You so much. Oh, God, it's a good thing that you brought it up right now. Shit. Let's get it out. Oh, yeah, let's just, let's just get this out of the oh. way right now. <laughs> oh, God. But honestly, it has been it has been a riot it's been a riot Look at it's you been guys. no it's been really it's this is the first time i'm working with her and it's not just on screen or while we're performing it's not that it's just like just the whole energy of the set is so amazing that that this bonding just happened organically it is, yeah it, it just happened yeah. and though like the story is about succession and we are competing against one another yeah. but uh, as soon as the director used to call cut, we were like, Hey! All the get all Although we would get, we would also get, he's not here, nah? we would also get Baja, you have to be in your character. Sometimes, sometimes. Nah? and sometimes he'd be talking to us only. And we're like, we're supposed to be in characters only. <laughs> After playing so many terrific characters, I'm curious to know, what is make or break for you when it comes to picking a role? What's got to be there? Obviously the characters, nah? I don't like playing um, very straight characters. Um, okay. And uh, yeah, it's just, there's a subject and the characters. I'm mm -hmm. a bit fed up of just playing. Um, I mean, most of the films have really nothing for you to really say or do, really. So yeah, it's the character. You know, guys, that really is the biggest boon of the OTT space. The freedom to explore new avenues and break the stereotypes. Also, just giving artists an opportunity to go beyond characters that are black and white. And I would think that this is what makes the audience even root for them, despite their flaws. Also on Hotstar, there's shows like Arya, where just women are given yeah. so much to flesh and take center Thank stage. God for that, yes. Are you guys having a lot? Of fun on set these of days? Of course. Definitely. These days, I mean, uh, this entire In shoot has been so empowering. It is, it's not just empowering as you, you know, get into your clothes and you walk on set and, you know, it's not just that. It's it's run by women. It's a matriarchal setup completely mm -hmm. yeah. from top to bottom. And there is no uh, husband or uh, 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 a son that is the point of contention. We are picking up guns. We are blowing people up. We are slashing their throats. We are, we, are, we are not. We don't need, we are not men. We don't need men in the show. <laughs> you know when you walk, you stride, and then you feel like, oh, yeah, it's like that. Oh girl. Yeah, yeah. It, 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 it brought a shift inside yeah, every it, one of us, and it has definitely made a shift in me as Angira. Yeah, and, and as, as Radhika as well. Yeah. Like, I feel I'm more confident. I feel I can. Take the word on. Yeah, 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 literally. I have it in me. What did you have to tap into, ma'am? Like, is she anywhere at all like you? She is, actually. She is the hidden me. So, it was a nice uh, way to get all my things out. Uh, violence, which I've suppressed <laughs> for so many years. So, it felt great to do this. Huh? These stories with powerful female protagonists are not just levelling the playing field, they're also just giving us the opportunity to explore fresher themes and as a result, we're getting meatier stories. The response has been overwhelming, so clearly they're doing something right. 
So why don't you talk to me about how a show like this kind of takes you away from that stereotype? Does it, and how does it? <clears throat> if it does, of what course, on a script level, okay. and also your director is coming in to check. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You are just going to say very nice things about yeah. you but you know now, now I think we'll change the narrative here yeah. a little bit yeah Okay okay let's really so, talk about the star of the show and uh-huh. get out <laughs> <laughs> This is our only chance to shine exactly. homie Exactly I love that Love him I love him Yeah and I love how he shows women Oh yes. 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 Oh yes. 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 So I want to talk a little bit about what do you think as women? What does it take to really flesh out a an impactful woman's character? I would say uh, to start off with, uh, it's the script and also the vision of the director who just mm-hmm. barged into our interview right now. He is. He has. He's a visionary mm-hmm. in terms of. showing women yeah. in a light that you are seeing us in mm-hmm. right now uh the way all our characters are etched out mm-hmm. the way we are playing them it's it's i would say it's all him i mean we are just you know abiding and, yeah and his characters are always like the way he portrays women yeah. they're always strong they might not be good necessarily great they can be yeah, it's it's always in the gray space but they're really strong and empowered and uh, it it you know it it stirs up something inside you it That's gives you power and every day on set it's like okay i own it yeah i have the power without um, telling me more than you can why don't you tell our viewers what we can expect from the show when it drops it is uh, extremely engaging it's extremely convoluted the twists and the turns and also it's a very uh, layered human story of the different characters and how they deal with all their uh, complexities their their pain their past the sort of contradictions in their present mm-hmm. their fear of the matriarch but wanting to be her ally the relationships between the sons and the bahus so yeah i think it will be extremely entertaining and i think it's something that no one's really seen before they're going to get everything they're going to get yeah um drama they'll get get humor humor love love passion they'll get, they'll get everything everything it's everything. a full package yeah. some kick ass women characters definitely. god knows we need that definitely. Yeah. Yeah. definitely and i i hope i hope you know when people are watching it especially women out there i mean i'm not just addressing this to women but when they watch it they feel like hi you know I that's what i'm talking yeah. about That's what I'm talking about. They can do anything. 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 I've been on many film sets, guys, but I have to tell you that there's something about the energy on this set that just sits right. Women in positions of power setting the benchmark for how a substantial female character can be created. You know what really caught my eye on this set while I've been shooting the behind the scenes is how many women you have as HODs. How does that change the energy on the set? What is it like to just have so many women in positions of power on set? This is my opinion. I feel that I, I feel women are way more instinctive, more sensitive, more in, in, intelligent when it comes to the uh, finer strokes, which for me is very important when I'm working. When there's only men on set, even finding a restroom is hard. So, like even tiny things like that change drastically. When there are women, I feel like you get more perspective. And it's amazing to watch them work because they are good at their job. They are not just here for you know gender equality, not at all. They are here because they are good at their craft. It's a safe space. It's inspiring in a way to see women handle so much at this scale, like the scale of uh, the kind of work that they are doing. it's just it's very very inspiring there's a certain heightened intelligence quotient when you have women calling and creating the shots i can't wait to see what i went behind the scenes to capture finally make its way on to disney plus hotstar mm-hmm.